The CT160 is available in four different configurations. 28 inch disc, a 32 inch disc, and a 36 inch disc in one cylindrical version, which is 30 inch. Let's look at the battery compartment. This is a 36 volt system. We can have three 12 volt batteries or six six volt batteries powering up this unit. The 160 has a three stage vacuum motor giving it optimal performance on all different surfaces. The 160 has a filter that precedes the vac motor protecting it from any type of dust or debris. The 160 has a 39 gallon solution tank which is filled right here and does have a pre-filter to prevent anything from getting into the solution tank. The recovery tank is 45 gallons. You have this lid that you can remove, go ahead and clean out the unit. You've got this dump hose to get rid of the dirty water. When the tank capacity is reached, there's a float that automatically shuts off the vac motor and raises your squeegee, telling the operator it's time to empty. This unit has a heavy duty squeegee assembly, which has a front blade and a back blade that have four edges to them. We've got a buckle system that allows us to simply remove the blade and flip it or turn it to the new edge. The unit has two stationary wheels in the back end that are non-marking tires. This is where the brushes are located. We have heavy duty bumper guards to protect the deck assembly. The unit is equipped with a heavy duty front drive motor. To start the unit, turn the key to the on position. This knob controls the speed of the unit from the snail to the rabbit this directional switch will control from forward to reverse. This portion here will control how much clean solution is delivered to the floor, from one being the least to six being the max. This switch operates the vacuum. This switch operates the brush motor. On the disc units, you can spin off or spin on your brushes or pads. This unit is equipped with a horn. The first part of the program is deciding on what language. English would be correct. The next one is going to be the program, program one. And brush pressure is what we'll decide. We can increase the down pressure by toggling up or down. The second is we want the brushes to turn in the on position in program one, so we leave it in the on. The next one is suction. We want the vacuum to work in program one. Water, we can choose it to be auto or we can choose how much water will be put down to the deck as you're cleaning. Auto will be controlled by the speed of the machine, meaning when you go fast, you'll have more water and when you slow down, you'll have less water. Power off, when you release the accelerator, everything will power down. Program two and three would be exactly the same method. To get out of the program mode, simply hold down the yellow button next to the display. And it goes back to the voltage and the hour reading. 